collective flowers, flowers, flowers. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to my channel. This is Adana, also known as the Afro Seed. Say, so read for the beautiful hands to collect. What up, collective? Hey, y'all. Flowers, flowers, flowers. One more time. <clears throat> flowers, flowers, flowers. <laughs> Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell mm -hmm. to book a private reading with me or to shop in my store. All that information is in the description box below. Okay, let's get into it. This is a channel message here, and the channel message is that your family members has paid a psychiatrist to watch you. Um, your family dynamic, foster family, real family, however it resonates in your story, child, okay? But there's a family dynamic here that's very toxic, that's very putrid, that's very nasty, vile, foul, and vile. In regards to trying to just to get you to just sit still, okay? You are considered a threat to this family dynamic because of the secrets that you hold in regards to what they have not only been doing to you, but what they have been doing to other people as well too. And they don't want other people that they have done bullshit to, they don't want them awakening or waking up um, because these individuals feel like they're the only one that went through, if that makes sense. But there are a lot of other people um, also within the family dynamics of the extended family. So like cousins, aunts, uncles, whatever. The family that you grew up with or the family that you, yeah, you grew up where you live with there, they're responsible for other, uh, I'll say failures, obstruction, destructions within the extended family dynamic as well too. It also extends to their to their friends too. So if your family, I don't want to say your, but just for depiction purposes, okay? I'll just say karmic family. So if the karmic family have their own set of friends or group or network, whatever, they also did that to some people within that group dynamic too. And they don't want the group dynamic that, that suffered by the hands of the toxic family they don't want them to speak out. So this is why they're going really hard on you. And they're trying to um, get the psychiatrist to determine you to be unwell. Okay? You're not unwell. Okay? That's what they want. That's how they want people to perceive you. But you're not unwell. So collectively, you have nothing to worry about. Now, with the psychiatrist here, I did tap into this energy because I just thought that since they want to be very intrusive and they want to tap into, or not tap in, but more so they wanted to spy on the collective, well, shit, I mean, shit, an eye for an eye. I'm big on that. I'm big for an eye for an eye. So if you think that you can spy on a collective and you don't think your shit not going to be bust wide the fuck open, think again, psychiatrist, okay? Number one. They will lose their license. That's number one. First and foremost, they will lose their license. Number two, they will seek, they will be in jail as well, too. And also, number three, because they're doing this in a very illegal way, without your knowledge, you're not a client of theirs. There's no client confidentiality. There's none of that, none of that there. Um, they're they are setting themselves up for a really huge lawsuit. Um, they are part of a actual psychiatrist group or psych psychologist group so for instance let's say that you're looking for a, like a doctor or let's say looking for a dentist the, that particular dentist or there'll be a, a slew of dentists that'll be in a particular network so in that kind of way this psychiatrist belongs to a certain type of network um so you are ex you are exposed or you have exposed so you're going to have to take it how it resonates in your story 
But the, the end of it all is that things that, that these individuals, these family members thought that they were going to take to their grave has been completely exposed and they're like freaking the fuck out. Um, and this is like they're they're still grasping at straws and trying to like get you to be quiet and shut up and stuff like that. So they reach out to a psychiatrist here to see what what their options are. So there is a psychiatrist that is watching you, taking notes and trying to see, you know, what's what and trying to basically run with what the toxic family dynamic has been saying about you. They're trying to make it stick or they're trying to make it to be true. <clears throat> and that's a fact. <laughs> okay, let's see. I know I said a mouthful, child, but... All right, what else, spirit? <laughs> yeah, overcoming obstacles is in reverse. They don't want you to overcome any obstacles. The obstacle for them is the truth. And they don't want the... They don't want... Hmm. They don't want the lies to be exposed. They don't want you to overcome obstacles with the truth because that is the only way in this instance or in your scenario, this is the only way that you can overcome these obstacles is by speaking up and speaking the truth. And they don't, they don't want you to speak the truth. So with the psychiatrist is coming in, this person has been paid money underneath the table here, um, which is also another no-no that, um, that they should not have done. What they also didn't realize is psychiatrists, they're not really smart. Even though they're psychiatrists, they're not that fucking smart. Truly, clearly. They took money, but they took money, laundered money. <laughs> the psychiatrist, unbeknownst to them, <laughs> received laundered money from this toxic family dynamic. Oh, me, oh, fucking my... <laughs> Oh, me, oh, my, how the motherfucking tables are stirring looking ending. Hmm. Hmm. Intelligence is in reverse. The psychiatrist is not smart whatsoever. I feel like we should do a, a, a psych evaluation on this psychiatrist. For someone that may have so worked so hard to get to this, to this stance, or status of their career, this is what you decide to do. You decide to work with bottom feeders, people that don't like to wash their front, their side, their backside. You decided to go in agreement with this toxic family dynamic because, of course, there's so many of them, all these people coming to, to this psychiatrist. Of course, the psychiatrist is going to believe it. Anywho, people nowadays don't have a mind of their own or they don't think for themselves. So... Um, the psychiatrist saw what kind of money that they was talking about they was bringing towards the table and they did it underneath the table. That's being exposed. Again, nothing can be hidden, okay? Um, <laughs> yeah, nothing can be fucking hidden. <laughs> oh, man. And these are people that's, that we supposed to pay for, for services. This is the bullshit they doing behind the scenes. Just. <sighs> Devotion. They lie so much on you and about you to this to just anyone that will listen, especially the psychiatrist here, like this psychiatrist is making this, making it, making it their duty to ensure that you don't speak up or speak out, spill the beans, continue to talk, whatever, however resonates in your story. But overall, in a nutshell, they're trying to do everything to stop you from doing that. And that's not going to happen. Volcanoes in reverse. So it seems like this family, this toxic family dynamic has a lot of connections. And I mean, what the fuck that's supposed to mean? Okay. And okay. But they have a lot of connections, a lot of toxic connections, a lot of, um, what's the word? Unsavory uh, connections. And they're supposedly or attempting to use it to their advantage. But none of that is, none of that is working out for them. <laughs> See, we got faith and we also got vision. So they don't see what's coming to them. I don't understand why they feel that your truth is threatening to their lies. Stop fucking lying. It's that fucking simple. Stop lying. 
It's not that hard to not lie. Stop lying. You don't want ramifications or you don't want to deal with the ramifications of your actions, Karmic. Stop fucking lying. It's truly that simple. It's that simple. I, 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 I don't get this. Like, this, is, this don't make no damn sense to me. Oh, God. It could be a Leo that's doing this. A low vibrational Leo. That don't even have the balls to come and say anything to you. This person may mm, transition. Ooh. 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 It's just a level of just diabolicalness, if that's even a word. But the level of diabolicalness that these 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 insects, these yuck, these spits of hawk and spits, like just yuck. Like every time I gotta read about the karmics, man, I I just I just throw up a little bit because it, it just doesn't make sense that this is grown ass adults I'm talking about here. Grown ass adults acting like this. Based on the the the, the decisions and the actions they made from the past. We talking about grown ass adults here that don't want to take accountability for the shit that they did on their own time and term, term and turf. Yeah, they working hard against you because you are rebelling against them. Community is in reverse. But by them doing that, what they're doing is that they're creating a, they're trying to push against you, which is the wrong thing to do. They're trying to oppress you. They're trying to put you in the opposition so that way you feel cornered or you feel stuck. Um, and they feel by doing that is by gathering glumps of people, dumbass people that flock together, um, dumbass people that's just only using one mind, <laughs> right? They're trying to get these, these flock of dumbass people here to be on one accord so that way it's more uh, sounding or it's more... Um, it's more uh, confirmed that what they saying about you is true. <clears throat> but you are protected. That's the blood. If you're gonna have sex for the first time in a long time, so this is this is for whoever it needs to be for. If you celibate, I'm not talking to you. Please leave me alone. Okay, leave me alone. All right, I'm talking about the one that's not celibate or soon to not be celibate. If you're about to have intercourse, all I ask for you to do is just use protection. That's it. I don't care what else you do. That's your business. All I ask from you, boo, is that if you're moving from celibacy to non-celibacy, all I ask for you to do is to use protection. That's it. I ain't going to, I'm not going into anything else. That's it. That's all I ask of you. Use protection. That's it. All right, let's see what else. What else about the psychiatrist? What else about the psychiatrist? We got the nine of swords. Cheese, cheese on bread. Cheese on bread. Look at this. Nine of swords and the judgment. So it seems like this psychiatrist here is going to be seen, of course. So you're going to learn the person's name, their archetype, their body. You're going to learn everything about this person. Basically, you're going to find out who the person is. And they're going to be scared. They're, ooh, they're going to be so afraid. <laughs> they hired they hired uh, private investigators. Private investigators are backing away from you. Um, they don't want their things being exposed. Like a walking truth, a walking sword of truth that just anybody that lie, you just like, hi -ya! you annihilating motherfuckers with the truth. Like, uh-uh, don't come the fuck over here with that. And a lot of people can't handle that shit. <laughs> so they're stalling right now. We have the hangman in reverse. They're stalling right now because they don't know what to do. So they feel by having this psychiatrist to study you to kind of see uh what's going on with you because they feel like you're off they feel like you're not all there they feel like you're crazy you're not any of that stuff you just have the fucking truth you're just telling the truth that's all this is they are doing damage control because you are telling the truth and normally when people are telling the truth the first thing dumbasses do is that they come together like a flock of cunts 
to say, oh, that person is sick. That person is crazy. You're not crazy and you're not sick collective. You're simply telling the truth, the harsh truth, the brash truth, the rough truth, the harsh truth that they cannot take. That have nothing to do with you collective. Continue speaking your harsh truth, your brash truth. Yeah, your hard truth. Continue speaking out, boo. Stuff the fuck they can do. They don't want that. If they don't want attention on them, tell them stop doing it. <laughs> Until then, I don't know what to tell them. I don't know what to tell the the, uh, the karmas. I just don't. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I go sleep good in my bed tonight. <laughs> And I go eat good. You ain't see my breakfast from this morning. Oh, uh -huh. shit. I go eat good too. Shit. We have the hermit. So they're in solitude now. They want other people to take the fall for what they've done to you. Okay. Um. So with the psychiatrist here, they're going to, because the psychiatrists don't want this type of heat. Okay. They've only heard of things like this, but they've never seen, I guess, witness it. Like, witness your gifts. Some of you guys are starting to come out more in your gifts, like on social media and stuff like that. And it's starting to cause, like, a raise of concern for these family members or toxic dynamic, whatever the fuck you want to call these trash buckets. Um, but it's starting to create a lot of concern because eyes are on you because you're speaking up and you're speaking out. And as you should. <laughs> okay. We got the seven of swords here. Yeah, they're they're um their lying, sneaky, deceitful ways is has caught up to them. Shit, you might not even be aware you exposing shit that you don't even fucking know. And you just exposing the child. Well, listen, tell them stay out your fucking energy, boo. Stay out the collective's energy. You don't want your shit exposed. Stay the fuck out the collective's energy. It's that simple, boo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's that simple. But you know they can't do that, boo. <laughs> I'm trolling. <laughs> And the more desperate that they become, the more they keep showing their hands. They won't have the I eat ass face, y'all. Welcome is in reverse. They're not welcome. And this psychiatrist ain't gonna want no problem, ain't gonna want no issues or no problems with you, collective. I'm telling you, they were in support of your family uh, for a big favor. <laughs> I don't understand how y'all getting these people to just, I don't get that. How are y'all doing that? How are you allowing other people to trick you? How? How? How, how you let other people trick you with lies? How? Child, you dodge a bullet. <laughs> you dodge a bullet. All that talking shit is going to, man, fake flexing, bruh. They did not hit the jackpot. They, man, there's phone conversation between a psychiatrist and this family dynamic here. Man, it's going to be a lot of shit being exposed, bruh. You know the feds watching. Let, let me let me get a fed some love. The high vibrant feds. What up, feds? Let me give you your flower. Let me tell you. Listen, this, this case going to be fucking stink. You hear me? The case going to be smelling stink. Mm. And everybody going to smell the stinkness. Lord, for the Hi. Ah, we got hustling. Uh 
<laughs> they hustling to try to get out of the situation here. Oh my God. Y'all sleeping with the psychiatrist too? Ay, ay, ay. Lord, Lord, yeah. These are the same people that said that the collective was sick. This is the same people that said the collective is the one that have mental issue. But you sleeping with a psychiatrist and you get somebody. You, you, okay. It, 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 don't make, it don't make sense to me. Make, make a wish is in reverse. What wish they making? What wish they making? So you giving them dirty dig or dirty puss? Child, please. please. Somebody going to be sick to their stomach, child. Intermittent fasting. Like, they not going to be able to eat. They not going to be able to sleep once they get their results back. If this psychiatrist didn't get their results back, this is some crazy stuff. Like, what? This is some... I, ooh, woo, child, that's crazy. That, that don't make no sense to me, boo. Mm -hmm. Expect the miracle is in reverse. <clears throat> That's crazy. And the psychiatrist just did it? This ain't no real psychologist. This is not no real psychologist. It just, couldn't, it just can't be. How do you go to school for... for you're, you're going to school to learn about the mind, to learn about the mannerisms and the way the behaviors of the mind. And this is this is this is the ending of how your career is going to end. Like you, you, what? what? This what we doing? So we don't have no coin. This what they doing? Not that don't make no sense to me, boo. Mm -mm. No spiritual protection is in reverse. That don't make no sense to me. That don't make no sense. Maybe that's why I said what I said earlier. If you're going to, or if you're going to change from being non-celibate, or sorry, celibate to non-celibate, use protection. Why are people afraid to use protection? I don't, I don't get it. Oh, Lord, child. <laughs> communication yeah there, there's a communication there's something going on with a family member within a dynamic in a professional but it's it, it just goes against a lot of like code of ethics and it, it, it's just very messy it, it's very messy it's very messy there's conversation about that that's taped Honesty is in reverse. They're not going to be honest here. They won't be scared as fuck. They failed. Yeah, they're going to surrender. They're going, man. They're going to be so afraid. They're going to tie all relationships or all connections to this dynamic here, and they're going to be in grief because they're going to be judged. They may not be able to work or receive their license again. It may be revoked like permanently, where they cannot. They can't have one. They won't be able to practice. And this is what worries them. And hey, I got to be honest here. I'm telling you, this person may. Y'all can figure that part out there. It's 
really starting to look like this group of dynamic or this family dynamic is causing so much. Well, God damn, my, uh, my tapestry came down. Maybe that's a, a message or a sign. Yeah, shit coming down. <laughs> For real. That's exactly what that is. I'll take it as a sign. Um, And the way that it came down, because I attacked it or I attempted to attack it, but the way that it came down here is that things are slipping or things are falling out of place and it can't, or it's hard to put back in place here. They've been doing this for years, for years, for years. Yeah, I'm telling you, bruh, money, I'm telling you, man, money is involved, bruh, like a van. Like, you know, when someone is doing like a stakeout or something, yeah, somebody was watching you, like surveillance in you. Your brother could have been involved in this. This is weird. This is weird as hell. Mm -hmm, Mark, this is so weird. They work together. I'm telling you, man, this is weird as hell. Oh, so goddamn weird, bro. It's a woman, okay? It's a woman's psychiatrist. That's what I'm... Man, spirit. Huh. That is watching carefully, bruh. <laughs> man. <laughs> but don't have a leg to stand on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Child. Don't have a leg to stand on. They can't buy a vowel. They can't get any help. They can't get any assistance here because it's recorded. It's on tape. Your father's involved in this. It's a family affair. Yeah, it's a family affair. It's a family affair. I'm telling the truth. They're going to make an example. <laughs> oh, my God. I, listen. <laughs> Just sit this one out collective like talk your shit but sit this one out say what you gotta say then sit, sit out it could be an earth sign you could be an earth sign they could be an earth sign somebody is very afraid or chicken you could be eating chicken while you're watching me okay but earth sign is what Taurus, virgo capricorn okay they can't rest because everything went left or all the things that they have done have went completely left here mm -mm -mm. so we do have flag as well too and I'm going to look at, it says green flag, but since flag is in reverse, it's like there were no green flags. It was all red flags. And they put them away in a place where they thought that no one will, will see, will hear, or anything like that. But yeah, they, they slowly, they slowly finding out differently here. What I'm realizing is that this family dynamic is like, a, they're like a blob of bacteria. They're like the worst case of, of a bacteria case that you can think of right and every person that they have molded or um pushed to do their dirty deeds or their dirty work for they either they is almost always they either end up sick or transitioned out based on the the things that <clears throat> these people decide to do for money like it's crazy what people would do for money it's really crazy a lot of this is going to come out around Christmas or by Christmas time, okay? A lot of this. Somebody's birthday could be around Christmas time or your birthday could be on Christmas. You're, you're, you're going to hear about this by Christmas, okay? So from now until Christmas, you're going to hear something, okay? We got warm in inches. Um, warm in inches. That's somebody, you know... This is this is somebody's, you know, down there. Okay. Somebody thing is a little warm. Okay. They played a game and they lost. <laughs> they did not win the game. I'm to bruh, the government. <laughs> the government is waiting by the door. Y'all gonna come back and tell me. 
All I want is some Oracle decks, yes. All I want is some Oracle decks. I want some fresh flowers too, yes. I want a nice big red velvet cake. I sure do like a three tier, uh-huh. And then I also want a big speaker so I can speak my shit. That's all I want, that's all I ask for. I don't ask for a lot, mm -hmm. I don't ask for a lot, I don't. <laughs> I don't ask for a lot. <laughs> okay, that's all I want, feds. Mm -hmm. They running for the hill, child. They running for the hills. They running for the hills after all this is coming out here. So, so far, your brother and your father together could have orchestrated this, could have did it together. However, as they see your story here, they could be the only ones that may have been in charge of doing this. So, however, resonates in your story. Okay. Yeah, they are. So, it seems like a um, father figure and a brother figure here have binded together with the head here. Have binded together to, to try to knock you off your square by lying, uh, lying about you to other people. And more so the psychiatrist here. Yeah, look, rabbit towards. So they went down the rabbit hole here when they spoke with this person. I'm just, man, did they did they ran a train on this heifer? Did they ran a train on this heifer? Oh my god. Listen, the plot thickens. The plot thickens. Somebody got into a car accident. Okay. Somebody's car is totaled. This is some crazy stuff. Somebody, I don't even know if I should say this. I, I'll just, I, I'll just say they're, that's, they're, mm, I don't even know if I should. Oh, that's their free transition way out. I'll, I'll say it that way. It could be a mature man that do this. <clears throat> to themselves the mature man could be a father figure so however ooh, because all the secrets came out oh my god yeah this person official person so they could be in some kind of like you see this regalia here so they could be some kind of like military, but you see it's a mature man. It's an older man. It could be a man in their 50s. Um, shoot, maybe this person could have born 1922 because if you were born in 1922, I'm, I'm sure people who were born in, there are still people that, uh, that are alive that were born in 1922. But let me just see, 2024, 1922, 102. So yeah, I'm sure there's still people that are living at that age. So Maybe you have a grandfather that was born in 1922. You may have had a father, a father figure here that was born in the month of May. I did say Leo as well. This father figure could be a Leo. Someone's birthday could be May 19th. Someone's birthday could be May 22nd. But this father, this is an elder father, is an older father. Could be in their 50s, could be in their 60s, could be in their 70s. Okay, so between 50s or 70s, here and they it, it just it oh my god this is crazy a lot of it came out and they may decide to pre-transition in that way with change and it's going to be a concern for other people wow this is some this is crazy this is like a lifetime story yeah because false person this mature man here this this is an elder person this is an older person that was doing some stuff that they should not have been doing and now all the things oh my god man family room all of the family secrets is out here and they're in their thoughts and they yeah they can't the only family members that came out so far was just a brother and brother and a um and a father. That's the only two signs that came out here. That's crazy. That is crazy. They're heading towards poverty. Wow. That that made a, a a left turn really really quickly. Um and again, please know this is a collective read. It's not going to resonate with everybody, okay? So just take what resonates and leave the rest. It's a collective read once again. So we have cleansing in reverse. It could be a Gemini, a low vibrational Gemini. This person can't cleanse or they don't have the courage to, 
to face the music or to face what they have done towards you. That could be a Libra as well. So it could be a low vibrational Gemini or a low vibrational Libra. Or because these two signs are air signs, this person could be in their head a lot. <clears throat> Chill. But Victor, <laughs> I'm laughing at the song, okay? I'm not laughing at the situation. I'm laughing at the song. But yeah, Victory is in reverse. Could be an Aries. Aries represents father or fatherhood. Could be a Leo. Positivity is in reverse. So take it how it resonates in your story. This person's luck has ran out and they are in agreement with that because they don't understand the way that the universe works. They, they operate out of lack. Um, so it could be a low vibrational Capricorn or a low vibrational Libra, a Leo, Aries, Libra, or Gemini, okay? Um, but this person here or this group dynamic, they don't understand the way that the laws of the universe works. Um, so they're really struggling with that. <clears throat> and all of this karma is just coming in at one time and they don't know how to take that. Yeah, they don't, they don't know. Imagine that. Imagine people out here that's causing a lot of chaos and harm and angst and, and just BS towards people unnecessarily. And when the tables finally turn towards them, they cannot handle it. They want to take the easy way out because they cannot handle what they put out. <laughs> I, I just, I, I was just, I, I would never understand it. I just, I would just never understand it at all. It's just, it's just... <laughs> Y'all just never understand it at all. Like this person is trying to deem you as mentally ill because you're telling the truth about what happened in the past. I, I... <laughs> Man, I, I, I just, child, I just, I, I don't know. I, mm -hmm. I just don't know, boo. <laughs> I just don't know. <laughs> this just don't make no damn sense to me. Yeah, thief, bad habits here. We have spiritual haters, so they could have been throwing, throwing things towards you spiritually too. They're getting readings done on you to see what's going on. They can't find anything. Your background is squeaky clean. There's even a romantic love affair. So this is for a very small few of you guys. So if you, there's a father figure or a brother figure and you are a masculine and you had a girlfriend or wife, either your brother or your father figure, you know, with them okay they you know they they, they slid in them yams boo uh-huh you may not know that you may have been uncertain okay maybe something happened to the point where you were trying to talk with your you know your wife or your girlfriend um and she just completely changed 180 360 is because she had relations with the father or the brother of your family ooh, ah, ah, yeah. I, I, ooh, ah, mm, 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 I don't get it. Uh, now I understand why spirit want to be to open up with use protection because the way people just raw dogging themselves out here is is really crazy. I, I don't get that. Yeah, drama starter, and they got this woman to walk away from you here to start drama. Yeah, and they became a stalker. So this is for a masculine that's going through it, going through this with a woman or a feminine energy right now. So we have stalker and looking you up. They're causing a lot of chaos in your life because of what your brother or father may have done to you. And hey, if you go with the same sex as well too, this still resonates with you with a brother or, or father here. 
your brother or father could be underneath the radar and they don't want people to know that but there's definitely an elderly person here that's into the same sex and they don't want people to know that and that's more so because of their way of living or the way that they grew up because they're older so you know they're going to have some reservations about that um but because of how they grew up it was considered you know um not a good a good look for them but they do things behind the scenes here so your daddy like your your pappy like to play behind the scenes. You get you catch my drift, okay? They like to play behind the scenes here, all right? You catch my drift, all right, now. You catch it, catch it, you catch it, all right. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, mm, mm, mm. So see beyond the past is in reverse. It's in reverse, but I want to put it upright. You see how that swan is black, but if it looks in, it look in the reflection, you can see the color. <sighs> Even though see beyond the past is in reverse. It's like, yeah, this person can't see beyond the past or they can't leave the past because they never healed the past because of what they've done from the past. So they've carried a lot of, of hidden wounds and traumas and the things that they have done towards you and other people within the family dynamic or their friend connection here they're not able to they're not able to sleep well at night so all of their basically their their bullshit their their skeletons their bones that are falling out of the closet is now catching up some and they can't handle it here inner conflict resolution is in reverse they can't come to a, a conflict resolution or an inner conflict resolution of self because they've never they never apologized for what they've done um, they've never made amends with what they've done. They never, they didn't do the work, you know, even though they went through what they went through or what they did, what they did towards other people, they never did what they needed to do to, to, uh, live a peaceful life because they were willing to go to their grave with this and not say anything, but no, they're going to go to their grave, but there won't be no secrets when they in their resting place. I'm just going to keep it real raw and funky with you, boo. <laughs> okay. That's all I got for you. It's just the raw, honest truth. That's all I got for you, boo. But, um, yeah, you asked Spirit that you wanted to know every little, I guess, intricate detail of what happened in the past. And Spirit like, all right, say less. I got you. Hold that thought. And boom, everything's coming to you as it should. Nothing can be hidden. It is what it is. Nothing can be hidden. If you don't want stuff to be out in the open, don't do stuff. It's, it's that simple. Don't do crazy stuff. You don't want you. You don't want to be known as a crazy person. You don't want to be known as that type of person. Don't do shit that will help you to be the person that you don't want to be. I mean, what are we talking about here? <laughs> Let's make this make sense, Jay. Make it make sense. Thank you, bud. And you know they butts stink. <laughs> Come off the Pettyville. <laughs> you just know they bust thing. <laughs> All right, I'm a chill. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, we got the moon in reverse. Okay, a mother figure could be involved, and then the five of swords. Uh, I'm hearing yes, but not as much as this father and brother figure, though. This brother and father could be like a duo. They do things a lot together, but they're trying to create, a, they're trying to continue or keep up this confusion, and they can't, okay? This father figure may have um, some importance here. Ace of Wands is in reverse. Stagnant, missed opportunity, okay? They also have a, a gift that keeps on coming. So just because they're older don't mean like they're a saint, okay? This person was a gardening tool, okay? Back in their they heyday, and they old too, but they can't handle they can't handle what they have done to the people they did in the past, and they can't handle the truth coming out. Because like I said, you are the truth bearer. You bring truth. You you give truth. You give it out like it's candy. You sure do. You want a piece of truth? All right, here, here, here. I got you. You want a piece of truth? It's like that. And they can't handle it. Like the truth can truly make people sick. Imagine that. You lying out here. And when the truth finally come out, it's making you truly sick. That's crazy. 
That's real crazy. Mm, mm, mm. Child. Uh, uh, uh. Let's see what else. <sighs> we got the devil here. Could be a Capricorn. Okay. Um, the Ten of Wands here. So someone's very burdened. Could be a Capricorn that's very burdened here. They feel trapped. It's a lot of entities on this group of people. Yuck. While they're going through that and they're suffering, you're going to be... Wow, damn, girl, Jackie. Woo. So we got the world. We got nine of pentacles and the star. That's you, collective. That's your energy. And then you got the death here for them. That's the end for them. That's it. They're very abusive. Knight of, Knight of Wands, they're very abusive here. They have no control over the karma that, they're, that they're, they're going through. They can't handle it. It's too much to bear. It's too much to handle. They went off of this ride. Well, where where were they where were they when you were telling them to stop doing it where were they they were nowhere they were nowhere to be found when you were going through what you was going through they sat and they watched they detached from you because they wanted you to detach from this world from this earthly world no they are they are they can't handle what they put out they can't handle the truth the truth of their 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 past is being exposed. They can't handle it. You got a manipulation that's in reverse. They can no longer manipulate others here. Sad. They have to surrender. Excuse me. Whew. Excuse me. They may try to come towards you. However, that resonates in your story. Okay, again, everything not going to resonate with you. But they may try to come towards you here to surrender or to surrender or to like apologize. So you you do what you will with that information. Okay? Not everybody going to be on board with that. And that is A-okay. I'm telling you, forgiveness in reverse. They may try to come towards you for forgiveness, but you don't trust them as you should not because they did a lot of shit behind the scenes. I mean, they... You psychiatrists and shit out here. This is weird, and they feel stuck. So, yeah. And you know what's also crazy? Is that the people that they did the weird stuff to, they got them to turn against you. It's weird. They did They did weird stuff to them. Uh, they tried to... What's the word? Try to... Uh, change the way they saw you or perceived you. But they were also... Mm. So I don't like saying the word victim. I like, to, I, I say victor because you're not a victim. You're a victor of your situation or your, you know, what, what transpired in the past. But in this instance, yeah, I'll just use it, use it for depiction purposes. And I just feel like with the victim here, like the ones that went through what they went through, but then they were kind of like shunned away or turned away from you here. It's like, they're going to wake up and they're going to realize like, you know, the things that you were saying was, was the truth here. Yeah, they're going to be guided or they're being guided to wake up or they're waking up. Yeah, the change. Yeah, they're waking up. <laughs> Man, memory. Yes, they're waking up. It already happened or it is happening. Yeah, they're waking up to the truth. And that's what they did not want to happen because you were the key sing so you were the key you had the key to the truth and once you started to speak up and out everybody else gonna start to wake up because it's like well you went through that i went through that too and i went through that it's gonna be like a me too movement it's crazy yeah pay attention people are paying attention to what you're saying to what you're doing here because you're speaking the truth boo <laughs> yeah you're speaking the truth somebody name could be ruth r-u-t-h I'm also hearing a Heath bar, H-E-A-T-H, -E Heath bar. That could be someone's favorite candy. 
I'm also hearing Snickers. I see Kit Kats. I see, um, what's that? Uh, cookies and cream. So someone's having like a candy party or you just like a lot of candy. So you could have been like binging on candy today or something like that. Okay. Oh man. Yeah, we got justice here, bro. Yeah, this is, this is going to be, uh-huh, uh-huh, I'm gonna stop right there. That's the family. Well, it ain't your family, but you catch my drip. I'm gonna stop right there, though, okay? Let's see what we got in this thing. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Someone's uh, making Kool-Aid, but you added, oh, well, well goddamn. Well, I mean, it completely fell, so. <laughs> And I'm keeping it too. <laughs> That's what we gonna call bloopers, you know? <laughs> but, um, it's funny as hell. What I was saying, um, I lost my train of thought. It's okay, it may come back. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, I said someone was making Kool-Aid, but they were adding like alcohol or something in it, okay? So, however that works. I'm hearing Jägermeister, okay? Jägermeister. Yegas. That starts with a J. Um, somebody's purchasing a VV or V dub, which is a Volkswagen. VV, your name could be Vivian. Your first name could start with a V, your last name could start with a V. I'm hearing Valentino. I'm also hearing a valve. So check your car valve or like the oil, something within the car that has a valve. Okay, I'm not a mechanic, but I just saw the word valve, V A L V E. Um, and that's just what came to mind. So Pay attention to whatever whatever part of the car has a valve, okay? So I just heard car and valve, so just pay attention to that, okay? Um, someone um, is raising a Ken, or if I'm not mistaken, I think a Ken is a, like a baby goat or so, or yeah, I think it's a baby goat. Someone's raising a Ken, or they want a little goat. Um, someone's having issues with looking for a job and I truly feel it's because of their age. You could be a little bit older. So someone could be experiencing a form of ageism. Um, someone lives in New Hampshire or they just moved to New Hampshire. Congratulations. The attorney, attorney, attorney general is involved in this. Okay. Prosecutors and all that, they are involved in this as well. This is not a figment of your imagination, okay? This is what they want you to think or assume, but it's not. You're telling the truth, okay? You're telling the truth, Karmic. Or, sorry, the, not shit, not, ah, shit. The Karmics are telling the truth, and here's why. They're telling the truth based on their mannerisms, based on their behavior, based on their actions, based on what you're saying. So, yeah, their actions or their behavior or the way that they're moving is Basically, their truth is being shown in that way. So I'll put it in that way. But we do have Fig. Someone loves Fig Newton, or you could be studying Newton, Sir Isaac Newton. I think he was like, uh, he was the guy that uh, studied uh, gravity. Someone could be studying geography. Someone's name is Rose, or you could be drinking Rose. You could be listening to Ricky Rawls, Rick Rawls, the balls. Someone's name is Rosalind. Someone was watching um, Neo. We do have Neo here. So you could be watching The Matrix, okay? Or you want to have like an aha moment after watching the, the Matrix, okay? Someone loves Avino. I'm hearing Nazinga. Somebody's eating a big steak or like a tomahawk steak. Just make sure it's like cooked all the way. I'm sorry. I know everybody like they stuff how they like. Yeah, I just see worms in it. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. So wherever you got your cut of meat from or whatever, however, child, just make sure it's cooked thoroughly because somebody may get sick from that for real. I'm being honest. I'm not even joking. Being honest. All right, let's see. Someone's working with fairies or you're starting to look up fairies or fays, okay? Or you may have had some occurrences with them, the fairies. All right. Um, 
somebody has high blood pressure, high blood pressure here. Uh, and this because of, you know, things that they've done is now out in the open. So this is why. Um, I'm hearing fava beans, F-A-V-A. -A. That could be your favorite beans. I'm hearing tonka beans. Someone's from Georgia. Someone's watching Guide and Light. You could be watching The Young and the Restless, those type of daytime TV shows. Um, so I'm hearing Jerusalem. Um, uh, someone named is Henrietta. Your name could be Hen for short. The police department is involved in this. Somebody need to go for their PPD shot or tuberculosis shot. Somebody's using aloes. You could be drinking the. You could be drinking the. Um, you could be drinking the like the the uh, the slimy part of the aloes. It's really good for you. Or you could be making things with aloes. Somebody's playing rummy gin. Someone's drinking gin. You need to be careful with AI because if you're caught doing something like illegal or something that you're not supposed to do, you can they they they're gonna be cracking down a lot on AI to be honest with you. Because there's a lot of people out here that's not using it in the correct way. That's crazy. All right, let's see what else. Somebody could be from Toledo, Ohio. What up, Ohio? Somebody could be from Kansas. Okay, what up, Kansas? Somebody could be from L.A. What up, L.A.? Hey, y'all. All right. Somebody could be from Detroit, Michigan. What up, Detroit? Detroit, Michigan. Okay. Got a lot of, lot of states here today. Okay. Somebody could be from um, Daytona, Florida. Um, somebody could be from Jamaica. I got to rep up my, uh, my West Indians. What up, y'all? What up, what up, what up? Um, mm -mm -mm. somebody, they watch you on Facebook. <laughs> let them watch, child. Let them watch. Let them watch. Give them a show. Um, somebody can be watching you on Instagram. So if you have a Facebook, if you have an IG, I'm speaking to you. If you don't have Facebook or an IG, I'm not speaking to you, boo. I'm speaking solely to the ones that has a Facebook or an IG, okay? All right, now. So for the ones that have social media, they're watching you. Okay. I do not know where my dice is at. All right, so I'm gonna hit the end it there. That's weird. You know what? Let me use that other. Um, let me use this deck here. I don't know where I put my thing. I just moved into my new place, so I'm all over the place. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Try to get it together. All right, let's see. <laughs> let's see. All right, we got second house and... All right, we got second and we got third house, okay? It's Sagittarius, so it could be a Sagittarius involved. I'm gonna just go with these older ones. So I said, so Sagittarius, I said Capricorn, I said um, Libra, Leo, Aries, Libra, Gemini, Leo, okay? So if that resonates, please like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Till next time. <laughs>